So, hi guys, I just bought um, three new decks for a very special reading that I have planned for a couple of days. It is about, um, yeah, what kind of spirit is around you? Is it more like um, extraterrestrials because you're a starseed? Is it angels? Is it um, power animals? Whatever. So, in order to do this, I bought three new decks and I thought about doing an unboxing video. Because sometimes when I do see cars that I like, I would like to see all of them so that I can decide whether I want to buy this deck or not. And so I just thought that we will do this right now and you can see whether you do like this deck if you want to buy it or not. And if you do like it, I do have plenty more decks. Some of them I already have unboxed because I've used them. But I would um, yeah, really appreciate showing those decks to you and then you can see for yourself if, if this deck is for you or not you know so this is going to be mystical shaman oracle um deck and guidebook i actually bought this on ebay from i think it came from china for like five euros about five euros and i kind of need to it won't really open easily so, okay, this is the unboxing video. It's not easy to unbox. Okay. Let's see what it is like. Oh, the ancient ones. Yeah, I bought this deck because, um, again, for a reading, I wanted to see, yeah, this the, the shaman about for whether some Native American gods around you again. So we've got the ancient ones, the Andean cross, the arrow, beauty way. Oh my God, the beloved. I love this deck. I bought it for this card, I believe. <laughs> the blade, nice, the child. We do have the circle. Completion, oh, the how do you call it? Or Ouroboros or something like that? And it's number nine, of course, it's a completion. Oh, if I'm too fast, just click on pause. It's corn, so I guess it's about harvesting. Council, there's no guidance book. I just remember, I guess this is the guidance book. Okay, this is um, when you buy the cheap version from China, but so what I'm in intuitive reader anyway. Coyote. The crow, oh, I love this. Pretty. The curse. I like that there's some dark cards in there too because, um, let's be serious, sometimes um, there's negative things coming up and you need to know what it is, right? You need to be aware of it. The drum, look at that image. The eagle. And there is the eagle. <laughs> Earth. Oh, I love this deck. Earth Keeper, Fire, Flow, The Gatherer, The Ghost Dance, The Giveaway, oh, nice, The Heart of Sky, Holy Mountain. I'm in love with this deck already. <gasps> hummingbird. I love hummingbirds. Um, <laughs> it's, yeah, it to me it means that some a specific soul is with me. So every time I see a hummingbird, I say hi, hi up there. Thanks for protecting me. The hunter. Yeah, it's my divine masculine's mom. It's. Someday I asked for a sign if I was really talking to her. If it's really her, she's been with me like even two years before I met my divine. Uh, can't talk it. Met, encountered my divine masculine. First time I looked into his eyes, and she's been with me two years before that. Never knew who she was. Of course, there was just this spirit. And one day I found out it was her. And then I asked Spirit if it's really her sent me hummingbirds and I have been seeing hummingbirds quite a lot ever since. Sorry, that was not part of this. 
boxing, unboxing the hunter. Jaguar, oh, I love it. This is focused. The journey. I like it. Because zombies often go through journeys, right? Lightning. The lower world. I'm loving this deck. Luminous warrior. Magic. Many paths. The medicine wheel. Metal world. The moon. The mystical shaman. The owl. Pachamama. I don't know if I'm saying this right. The rainbow. The rainmaker. The rattle. Sacrifice. The seer. Oh, that's um, the Primon tribe, I believe. My cousin. He's half German, of course. His mom is my mom's sister. But his dad, he's from Venezuela. And my cousin's great grandfather, he was actually chief of the Pimont tribe in South America, yeah, in Venezuela. And they had makeup like this, like the red eyes. So maybe Pimont. I don't know. The serpents. The smoky mirror. The sorcerer. Soul Retriever, the Sparrow, the Staff, Stanster, the Sun, Sweat Lodge, Taming the Winds, Thunder, the Time Master, look, number eight, Eternity, I love it. Tree of Life, the Apple World, Vision Quest, Water, Wild Woman, Wind, and the Witness. 64 cards. That's a lot of cards. Beautiful, beautiful illustrations. It's, um, they feel good in my hands. It's not, um, very thick but still it feels good it feels um like soft there's somehow like there's like some layer on it let's see if they're easy to shuffle because that's important too yeah. okay I really really love this deck it's um I like the size you see I have tiny hands and often decks are like really really big so I can grab it if you have small hands it's it's good to grab and yeah it's good to shuffle they actually I like the quality and the jaguar came out uh, it's 28 10 new beginning <sighs> It's like I have the feeling like somebody watching you. Maybe there's somebody who's like watching you, the viewer. But it's like something precious, like like a moon. Maybe it's a divine masculine watching his divine feminine. I don't know. I was not doing a reading right now. Anyway, this is the mystical shaman oracle. I am absolutely in love with this deck. Absolutely in love. So if you liked it. Go get it <laughs> and let me know if you do like this kind of unboxing if you like um, seeing those cards because again sometimes when i want to buy a deck and you buy it online you can't see all the cards and that really sucks so yeah because if you do like it then i will show you my other cards as well and then you can see whether they are um, whether you're interested in them or not so anyway that was um this deck and I will now record the next one. Bye!